The gravitational force is a force that attracts any object with mass. Every object, including you, is pulling on every other object in the entire universe. This is called Newton's Universal Law of Gravitation. The universe has a lot of forces, a lot of pushes and pulls. We're always pushing or pulling something, even if only the ground. But it turns out that in physics, there are really only four fundamental forces from which everything else is derived. The strong force, the weak force, the electromagnetic force, and the gravitational force. The gravitational force is a force that attracts any object with mass. Every object, including you, is pulling on every other object in the entire universe. This is called Newton's Universal Law of Gravitation. Admittedly, you don't have a very large mass and so, you're not pulling on those other objects much. And objects that are really far apart from each other don't pull on each other noticeably either. But the force is there and we can calculate it. Example. Let's we have an object around the Earth. If the gravity does not exist then the reaction will be like this. You can see in this video. So object will never move around the Earth if the gravity does not exist. The direction of the object is same as the direction of the object. As if you see the formula of gravitational law then you can find out that. Gravitational force is inversely proportional to the square of the distance. Notice that the distance, r, on the bottom of the equation is squared. This makes it an inverse square law. Because of this, if you double the distance between two objects, you reduce the gravitational force between them to a quarter of what it was. Or if you triple the distance between them, you reduce the force to a ninth of what it was. Or if we go the other way, having the distance between two objects multiplies the force by a factor of four. This can be used to make rough comparisons between situations.